everyone. I'm Alicia Anderson, and welcome to the swimming hole. Ugh. I was supposed to meet some friends at the swimming hole, but how did I end up back here again? I wouldn't be surprised if I ran into Shrek out here. Ugh. Oh, ooh, ooh. so many mosquitoes. Gross. All this stagnant water is just a breeding ground. I'm calling the code compliance office. This place needs a good old fashioned cleanup. Ooh. We have concern for two major mosquito diseases within the city of Fort Worth. Uh, one would be West Nile virus, which is monitored routinely throughout the summertime, uh, throughout the mosquito population. The other main concern right now is Zika, which we haven't had a huge problem with as far as uh, local transmission, so the mosquitoes don't have Zika yet here. But uh, it is a concern that if people come back from their travels, that they may bring Zika in and then our mosquitoes could get it from biting a person. Limiting the number of mosquitoes in your area is very important. The best thing to do is drain your standing water. Any kind of container that may hold water for five to seven days would be a potential place where mosquitoes would want to lay eggs and then hatch out of. So even buckets in the backyard, dog bowls, old tires if they happen to be laying around, those are all good containers for mosquitoes to breed and, and lay eggs. And then to prevent bite, uh, wear your DEET and uh, wear long sleeves if at all possible. I know it's Texas and it's hot, but Wear long sleeves and long pants, if at all possible. Try to avoid going out. Dusk and dawn is very good for the West Nile type mosquitoes. Um, unfortunately, the mosquitoes that may transmit Zika do bite during the day as well. So it's a little bit harder to say that. If you see standing water on a street or an empty lot or even an abandoned swimming pool, you can call the city's hotline at 817-392-1234. Here's a look at other events happening in and around Fort Worth in the next few weeks. For a listing of more events and city meetings, you always can check the calendar at the city's website.